there have been a number of enhancements to some of our geometric items in PowerInspect 2015 R2. Probed planes, lines and compound lines now allow you to specify the fitting method that is to be applied to the feature. The fitting method can be accessed by raising the Modify Item dialog for the feature, then selecting the appropriate method from the fitting algorithm selection control. You can see the effect immediately on the item in the CAD view as each selection is applied. In previous versions of PowerInspect, the parameter that determines the search zone for projection of surface inspection points was a single parameter for inspection groups and GD&T profile items. So if the user changed this parameter value, all the GD&T profile items would also be recalculated. We have now introduced a per item proximity criteria parameter for all GD&T profile items to control the search zone that each point must lie within to be considered for the GDNT calculation. The PowerInspect reference help provides a good description of how the proximity criteria parameter is used for surface inspection. Now, let's look at the surface inspection group. We can see the area here has quite large deviations. These can easily be excluded from the surface profile calculation by changing the proximity criteria parameter. If we reduce the proximity criteria to 1.5 mm, we see the number of points considered has reduced from 30 to 18. You may also notice the measured error has reduced significantly as a result of the points with a large deviation being excluded from the calculation. This filtering can be very useful if we are inspecting a part where an area of the surface has large deviations due to springback after it has been removed from a fixture for example.